Better than that. All right, here's, a, here's what's better than that. Outside on your Thursday. Can you believe we're going to start spring officially on Saturday? Does this feel like spring? It's 81 degrees outside, winds out of the south at 6. And you know what? It's going to come in like a lion. Spring, right? 83 is our unofficial high for today. That's already six degrees above average for this time of year. It's not where anywhere near the record, and the record is actually not that old. 95 on this date, set back in 2017. I think I remember that. It was a very sweaty St. Patrick's Day the day before. Clear skies. We've just had a few high clouds, just a few radar returns, just some Virga up north. In fact, we've got a almost stationary low pressure center. You see that? That counterclockwise rotation of the air up there. That's kind of helping enhance or kind of making this high pressure get stronger. That's just right over top of us. So that means tomorrow, Saturday, we're talking well above normal temperatures. And we're going to watch that low as it kind of tries to make its way to the north of us. That could squeeze out. There's not a lot of moisture with this. It's going to draw up a lot of dry air for south central and central Arizona. But the northern and northeast corner of Arizona by Sunday night, we could see some showers kind of ring out of those clouds. It won't be a lot. End of next week, I think we got a better chance. Here's a look at your daytime, daytime, overnight lows. I'm stuck at 10 o'clock, right? Tomorrow, 84. I might have to bump this up to maybe 85, 86 because of today's high. 58 in Flagstaff, 86 in Gila Bend, and 87 in Yuma. So the forecast looks to be good for that first day of spring. 86 degrees. A little cooler with the passage of that low. It's going to bring down a little cold air, but it's mostly going to be dry for us. 78, 76 on Monday, 75 on Tuesday. <clears throat> Excuse me. Wednesday, Thursday, temperatures will start to bump back up, closing in on 80 by next Thursday.